I've decided this place needs an Enderman farm. <laughs> and not just this kind, not the kind I'm using right now. I just need some Ender Pearl. No, instead we're going to build the classic Nembon Ender Mini, because I am a little bit tired of sitting on 20-something levels and not being able to repair the tools that need 33 levels to repair towards the end of their lifespan. So I'm going to set up an Enderman farm, that way we can have a permanent XP farm here on the server. And this is only mildly less terrifying to do now that we have a Lytra. <laughs> But once we're down there, I've got plenty of leaves we can use to bridge out. We're going to get 128 blocks from the island, and I built one of these in the Minecraft Survival Guide world recently, so I'm pretty familiar with how the setup goes. And this has happened exactly the same way as it happened when I built it in the survival guide, in that there's now an enderman standing on my shulker box. Well, I will need to dispose of him, because unfortunately the next part involves summoning an endermite, and I don't want this guy to interfere. I think the only difference between this one and the survival guide one, though, is that I'm going to give myself a lot more room around here, so that I can set up the endermite, because I don't really want to risk falling off into the void. But we've got our minecart pinwheel set up here, all we need to do is spawn in an endermite and then name tag it. And I've had this name tag lying around from since the days when I thought I was going to maneuver a witch into splashing a villager with a potion, which is why it's named Brunhilda. But this is going to be the most painful part, is getting the endermite spawned in, so <laughs> let's give this a try. Well, after three stacks of enderpearls, I've come up with absolutely nothing, so <laughs> let's go and get some more of those, and let's see if we have any luck with the next three stacks. There we go, finally, Brunhilda is here. Now let's get you in the minecart, my dear. There we go. Now all we should have to do is break out that rail, make sure we've got a rail in there underneath the minecart, which is going to be the tricky part here because the endermite is a little rowdy. And now if I approach with a shield, I should be able to slot this endermite into place. Let's put a block there, have some steak, because the last thing I want right now is to be killed by an endermite for my second death on the server, and... There we go, rolled safely into place. What's most important is that we have those layers of carpet up there around the endermite that are going to protect it from any enderman that would want to do it harm. Now let's sneak back into the farm to apply the last few layers of carpet. We should be able to break out that torch and the enderman farm will be good to go. So breaking this torch, the enderman should start pouring in once we're back on this side of the farm and I'm going to put some walls in place to make sure that we don't end up overreaching and... Here they come, yeah, that's right. And there's nothing more satisfying than having a nice, reliable XP farm up and running. The only other things I'll want to do are install a water elevator so that people without a light track can get to and from the farm with no issues, and I'll probably install some safety rails along the outside here so that people can use the farm with a relative peace of mind.
Ah, oh, it feels good to have another fake coin in the hand again. I figured it was time to take down the dragon on my own, and I think we fared pretty well. Got tossed into the air a couple of times, but always managed to come down safely. And now we have a nice amount of levels from the Enderman farm, which has had a couple of minor improvements. I've added the safe fall and the bubble column for people who want to use the farm that don't have elytra, and I've added some safety rails to the sides there so that people aren't going to fall into the void. Also added a bunch of carpet with the moss so that the endermen don't follow you back. I think this is all looking pretty good. So I'm going to return to my dig with all of these levels, which should be enough to repair my two most expensive tools at this point, and I can always return to the farm anytime I need a bit more XP topped up. I'm going to have to tuck this coin away because I still technically owe one of those to Owen if he dies, and I think it's probably time to get digging again. Well, we've got a Silk Touch enchant coming up on this book. I'm absolutely going to take that, but then these two hoes both need 33 levels to repair. So we're going to get that done. And just like that, all of my levels have been reduced to nothing. <laughs> so we're going to have to go back to the farm to get a few more of those. But for now, at least I can continue on my latest chunk over there in the corner, which I'm mining out with moss and hose simply because it's too far out of the beacon radius for the effect to really apply for this entire chunk. Fortunately, I still have some copper that I smelted in here, so I can fix up my pickaxes with a few extra levels as well. <laughs> and now we know the Enderman farm is there for us. Let's get digging. Oh, I was in under the wire. I think I literally got my last signatures two seconds ago, but uh, yes, I... It's, yeah, it's not like everybody's meeting up right there to get everything going, but yeah, hey, no. you did it. You made the timer. Enjoy. Oh, have another fake coin. A second coin. I have two now. Yay. Woo, you can save somebody. Yeah, just about. Just about. Gosh. Kind of. Yeah, Maybe half half of somebody now. Oh, oh, is it that day? Oh gosh. Okay, oh, right. It's that day. Yeah. It's that <laughs> oh day. no. Oh no. All right. Well, uh, yeah. I will. I will hide this away, and uh, hopefully, I can team up with somebody at this point. It's o'clock. Yeah. Nice. Yay. Wow. Welcome to Hi. the mystery merchant auction. Oh. I'll be auctioning off. Five mystery items oh. in the form wow. of maps, which you oh. must then use to locate your mystery item. Oh, oh. it's like a lucky box. A quest. Yeah. Cool. It's a like quest. when you buy like returned Amazon parcels. Exactly. <laughs> yeah, it's like we like all that. do. <laughs> we, we it's love just doing like that. that. As long as you offer something of more value than the last bid, your bid will be accepted. Ooh, okay, the first item we have. Uh, available is this map to an item of protection. Ooh. 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 Can I start the bidding at one pot? I'll one do that. Flower pot. Do I have one, flower pot? We have one flower pot over here. We have one 32 stack of potatoes pots. over here. I, we have a stack of I, flower uh, pots. A diamond <laughs> helmet. Who said that? A, Who said the a, a, di a, a diamond helmet over here. Wow. 64 oh. lanterns. 64 cherry okay. leaves. Is Half it? a stack of diamonds. Oh, oh half, half a stack of diamonds has it. Can anybody beat half a stack of diamonds? I'll do uh, half a stack plus one diamonds. Oh! Half oh. a stack plus one diamond has it. What a fate coin! Oh! oh. That's oh. Really in the business to be giving those away. Really valuable Big spender. Okay, Very one, valuable. Actually, the diamond is worth more to me right now. <laughs> <laughs> Sold to Whoa. the man who's terrible Whoa. with his money. Mm. Well, going once. Nice. Yeah. Someone bid. Go <laughs> <I'm doing twice. laughs> <laughs> Sold for three fake coins. Yay! Two diamonds. Ten diamonds. Oh, this friend better be good. <laughs> no, Jenny, no, you're not getting a friend. friend. You're not getting a friend. <laughs> I'm joking. Got no friend. Quasha, Lizzie, have you come out of this with four fake coins today? <laughs> I have, yes. I've come out on top. You could ah, say, you've but let's right do it now. Thirty-four. Lizzie now has four fake coins. Uh, I thought it'd be cool to announce one. Uh, that officially closes this challenge and is going to be starting the next one. Where welcome, oh. first and foremost, to the mid game officially yay. oh things are getting a little oh. bit more difficult Woo, yay. Things, yay. things are getting really yay. mid Difficulty. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> they were they were early before. Now that now it's just mid. Decidedly Anyways, mid. the cost to revive is now four tokens. So what? Oh, oh what? Spenny. Four. Oh, no. oh, I don't yay, like that. Yay! And follow to. me, everybody. Oh, okay. Oh, yeah. 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 I'm not following yeah. people aimlessly. Welcome oh, to the week three oh. challenge. Ooh. We got a little bit of a different one in this one here, where there's actually two challenges. So you have the ability to earn two fate coins. First oh, up, nice. oh. you will be assigned a buddy at random. 
you will right. get somebody else on the server. Oh. If your buddy dies at any point during this two week period, you lose. You fail. Oh, you don't yeah. get no that coin. Jimmy, no but oh. no you still Jimmy, have no the Jimmy. chance. You still have the chance for this a special <laughs> task. Ooh. 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 You will also be given one task. If you can complete the task before the end of the week, you get a coin. Oh. End of the week nice. or oh. end of two weeks? Week? Uh, two weeks. Two weeks. Sorry. Okay. Yes. Okay. The end of the yeah. session. They, These both he... both run for two weeks. So. Oh yikes. Gotta keep somebody alive for two easy. weeks. Uh, you can determine that yourself by the task that you get out of there. The tasks, you can trade them with other people. You can barter them, move them around. Oh, Each mm -hmm. task can only be completed by one person. And in order to turn in your task, you have to show the book at the end. So you have to have the ta you have to have the book and the task completed. Cool. You don't get? Okay. Cool. Yeah. Great. Yeah. 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 Cool. yeah. Right. Who do I so get? We... X. Hey. hey. All right. Oh. I keep you safe. No, no, no more. No more. No more chicken deaths for me. Uh. Uh, no. I'm gonna. I'm gonna. I'm gonna child safe your whole. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Excuse me. What, <laughs> what? <laughs> what happened? Huh. Don't take that out of context. <laughs> My yeah, buddy yeah. is yeah, our auctioneer, Lizzie. Oh. Oh. Good luck to you. You've already revived me once. <laughs> yes, and uh, now you have a diamond helmet, at least. So that's that's going to help. Uh, Soon I will. Have and, will. And my task is task number 13. <laughs> get the <laughs> Feels own, Like Home advancement. What even is that one? What's that? Oh. Strider in the Overworld. Home. Oh, Strider. Oh. Oh. You've got to ride like 50 blocks. In, in, a, in a lava very... lake. Yes, I remember. Yeah, <laughs> Okay, yeah. fun. Looking forward to it. You're gonna have to tell me what you're what you're even doing here because I'm not sure. <laughs> yes. So, this entire area is getting dug out all the way to bedrock. I've decided to start digging it out chunk by chunk so that I can avoid oh. slime spawning and ruining my day every time I do any digging. So I have a system where you can randomly choose which chunk to dig out, or you can pick one. I can provide you with equipment that will work with the haste beacon if you don't already have efficiency 5 because that's what you'll need for oh, yeah, insta mining. I have efficiency 3. Great. Okay, I can I can provide you with some equipment and I can provide you with shulker boxes. Cuz you're trying to keep all the stuff, right? I I'm, I'm trying to keep all the stuff, but also if you want to keep any of the stuff, you are welcome to keep any resources from the dig basically. Oh, like diamonds? Yeah, if you find any diamonds, feel free oh. to keep them. I have a ton of diamonds at this point and I'm using them to create more pickaxes mostly, so it's uh <laughs> it's it's all happening. Can I have a, a a chunk somewhere in the middle so that I don't mess up the walls? Yes, absolutely you can. And the other thing is if you want a set of elytra, I can go and get you one as um <gasps> like like yes. Part, part of your work equipment because as, so I don't die. as previously discussed I'm in the business of keeping you alive right now yeah. so uh, yeah I'm gonna go and buy some elytra I think sausage has some available in a shop oh, at spawn selling them? yeah oh, yeah because he, he went and got like six sets of elytra so this I can go and time I've been using my legs. How embarrassing! <laughs> I know, right? When you could be having wings. Oh, yeah. That's so stupid. Um. So I can I can grab you some of those, and then you'll be able to like float down to the chunk, and I can probably hook you up with some fireworks and stuff. Right. So here is your uh, company mandated elytra, <laughs> and Thank you. I'll give you three stacks of fireworks. Ooh. And I'll also give you some shulker boxes so that you can grab any of that stuff. And okay. feel free to keep okay. any of the boxes and stuff because I have plenty of those. <gasps> if you want to use those to take resources home with you, you can. This is turning out to be a lot better for me than it is for you. I think. <laughs> well, I think I, I'm scamming you, I actually. I mean, what I get out of this is a hole that's dug out faster. And what I'm really, ah. <laughs> what I'm in, the, I, I'm in the the business of saving time here. So that's that's really where we're at. Um, and here is an efficiency five. Silk Touch pickaxe. <gasps> now, Ooh, okay. my rule so far has been not to use mending on any of the tools that I use for this dig because I'm basically using them up until they reach zero durability, repairing them, and then when they get too expensive to repair, I bury them around the circle with like a monument. What? Um, okay, so I should try and not use this up entirely, but use it almost entirely. Yeah, I mean, if you want to do that. If you want to go away and put mending on it, that's fine, but it's a personal challenge for me, not necessarily for everyone who wants to help me out. So uh, if you okay. if you want to go away and put mending on it, that's fine. If you want to go away and put the mending and unbreaking on your elytra, obviously that's fine, but they don't have many unbre unbreaking right now, so be careful that they don't break oh, midair. <laughs> okay. Oh, okay. Right. Oh, now I'm scared. Yes. Okay, wh where's my hole? Where's right. my chunk? Uh, so hop down the vines over here. I guess if you want one that's sort of in the middle, and if it's going to be away from some of the other chunks, then maybe this one. 
will be good. This is Ooh. chunk F4. F4, my favorite. There you go. Yeah, favorite key on the no, keyboard. Wait, I like F5. <laughs> well, confused. Either way, uh, if you now press, <laughs> if you press F3 and G, you will see the chunk borders all around uh, us. Yes. And so that will give you the outline of where you need to dig. Um, it doesn't need to strictly stay within that outline, but that just helps me with organization and stuff and gives you okay. a fixed area like to dig in. The corner is here. Ooh, yes. Shoot. That yes. is fast. Yes. Uh, yeah. <laughs> Digg hey, digging like this will be fast, so uh, try not to dig down below you. Whoa. But then, yeah, if we uh, we dig out the outside area of this, then that'll give you an idea of the space that you're working in. It's this fast until you get down to deep slate level, at which point I have been using moss because that allows you to instamine deep slate if you just convert all the deep slate to oh, moss. Oh, genius. I have a bunch of hose too. Yeah, yeah. I know you have a bunch of moss and you don't have the deep slate. I thought you wanted to keep the materials. I've kept a decent amount of the deep slate already. I have mined a bunch of that manually and I'm going to basically be rebuilding all of the terrain that gets scooped out of here up in the sky as though it's been carried off by this sci-fi drilling machine. And Ooh. I'm only building the outside. So I'm trying to like, ah. I I'm probably going to do like caves and stuff like that if they appear from the outside, but the rest of it is going to be hollow. So I don't need solid material for the entire thing because that would be placing like 2 million blocks or something. Mm -hmm. um, yeah. So yeah, that that's the idea at least. Okay, cool. I'm excited. Yeah, yeah. I'm excited, I'm excited to, to work. I yearn for the mines. <laughs> there you go. I'm excited to have a worker around. And I'm going to be working a little bit more on this chunk over here that I'm currently digging out that sort of, part way done um so if you need anything give me a shout okay you'll be you'll be impressed you'll see how quickly <laughs> i dig out this entire chunk just watch me i'm looking forward to it Oh, you did! Oh, thank you so much. That's that, that's uh, a little bit less equipment overhead for me to worry about. But I uh, I just have a question. Do you have any enchanting levels? Can you combine my unbreaking mending hoe with my efficiency four hoe? I have absolutely zero levels right now, but <laughs> I do have some copper smelting in here, so that might give me a few. Wait, I have so Oh, also I have some smelting over here. <laughs> I like how you've got your own Ooh. way more organized storage than I have as well. Yeah, I didn't want to interfere with yours, but I also didn't understand yours. Enough oh to yeah, even no, that's try. <laughs> there is nothing to understand. It is it is <laughs> pure chaos. Put things in chest. <laughs> yeah, absolutely. Just get it out of the way as quickly okay. as possible. I think I have enough levels now, actually. All right, sure. I keep stepping on this and accidentally. Oh like, yeah, G generating new <laughs> chunks for you to dig out. You're yeah. like, no, no obligations, no extra stuff to do. Okay, have my hoe. All right, sounds like that was successful. Give me two seconds to put away this and right. Got a little bit of moss as well. Yes, yes. So uh, the moss will not be a problem after a while because in here I have the uh, oh, bone. I have the moss bones. mining kit. Um, so this includes not only a ton of bone blocks if you want to keep all of the moss, uh, mm -hmm. but it also has the stuff that you need to set up an automatic composter. So all you got to do is a chest, oh. and then like two hoppers into that, two composters on top of there. Two more hoppers, oh, wow. and then a double chest on top of that, and then anything that you put in the double neat. chest, compost it. So uh, that will actually supply you with enough bone meal to do the entire thing. It becomes oh, self-sustaining. Self yes. Yeah. So uh, if you want to do that, then go for it. If you want to keep the moss, there's more bone blocks up here as well. So if you run out of bone meal at any point, you can come back up and replenish oh, that. Okay. 
I'll see. I'll 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 I'll, I'll do the composter. Sounds so good. I take all of the the whole thing, the composter. I mean, take I the shulker box if it them. helps, because <laughs> uh, uh, yeah. I'll I, just take this in my inventory. This awesome. Is fine. And then what I tend okay. to do is I dig a two block wide tunnel, basically straight down on the neighboring like oh, wait, chunk let's go. over. Show me, show yeah, me. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I will, I will demonstrate. The wandering trader has showed up to admire your handiwork <laughs> as well. He's just got two llamas there in a hole. Hope he doesn't fall down. Yeah, yeah. He has, he has dangled a few llamas around here, yeah. so uh, he's, he's not my favorite. But, um, so what I tend to do, right, is I, I get into the wall of a chunk on this side, and I'll just dig out a couple of blocks, and then standing between the two blocks, I'll dig straight down one side and straight down the other side, so that you don't risk like falling. And then right. I'll dig a hole in the wall. That's where the bone meal chest goes. And then I attach the composter to that oh. so that that can keep composting stuff while you're digging out the rest of this area. Oh, okay. And then basically once you pass the composter and it becomes a pain to jump and get stuff in the chest, that's when I move the composter set up down a few more blocks. And I just keep Wait, doing so. that throughout the chunk. And then do these need to be like individual chests or can this be a double chest? Uh, double chest because then it splits it evenly between the two composters. Oh. I didn't know that. I've yeah. also only done a single composter. Yeah, it's handy okay, so having that's double chests. Yeah, so now start bone mealing no. moss and it will it will spread to all of the deep slate. It won't cover any of the ore blocks though, so you still get to keep those. Ooh, okay. <gasps> there okay, you go. And then I hoe. Ooh, yeah. genius. Yeah, so I tend to go bone meal in one hand, hoe in the other hand, and then just absolutely spam the place. Ah, okay. Oh, so you spread it from here. Do you do the whole yeah, I tend to do that. I, I do the whole thing all at once, just because it's easier than doing like little pockets of it. I don't want to like go into the neighboring chunk though. It do shouldn't spread to any that? of the walls. That's part of the the joy of oh. digging it out a chunk at a time. Is that skulk would spread to the walls, but moss doesn't. Oh, perfect. Okay, that's what I was worried about. Was, yeah, because it's so neat, and yeah. I was worried it would be unneat. <laughs> moss is actually really good for digging out very specific shapes. I was considering doing this entire circle with moss at one point, but that was just going to be wow. so much bone meal. Feel free to continue collecting any ores. You'll probably start hitting diamonds at a certain point. Keep all of them. I hope so. And, I haven't uh, got any yet. Yeah, yeah. No, you'll you'll definitely get some in this area. I have branch mined out a bit of terrain underneath this, but I don't think this chunk is covered in that. So you should encounter plenty of stuff the further down you go. Okay, cool. Oh yeah, this is cool. All right, well, I'm glad you like it because you're gonna be doing this for a little while longer. <laughs> okay, how far down am I? I'm at level five? Yeah. Oh, how far have I got to go? Um, It goes down to negative 59 is when you start getting bedrock. Okay, and so that's not bad. And so once you find bedrock, just leave all the bedrock in any of the deep slate that's at that level. Just consider that the floor and you, don't need, to, you don't need to take okay. everything else out, you know? Got it, okay, thank you. All right, good luck. <laughs> Thanks. Oh no. Oh? 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 Oh no. <laughs> Where did that happen? Where did that happen? Oh, please. Oh no. <sighs> well, that's unfortunate. <laughs> oh, oh my savior. <laughs> Jimmy. Right, what's, what's happened? J Jimmy, Jimmy. I, yeah. I had one job. <laughs> What was the job? I, I I had to protect Lizzie. Lizzie's my person. Oh. And and she, and she just came over here to work in the hole. <laughs> and and I'm the, guessing her grave is down there. Her grave is down there. She died of fall damage. And I think I I gave her an elytra, but it wasn't enchanted, and I don't know if it broke or if she just like fell awkwardly or something. She says she's on her way, but um I've <laughs> I've just failed the challenge. <laughs> Oh, fantastic. Yeah. Wait, it hasn't even been that long. No, it's been like two days. <laughs> Wait, which, where, where's the grave? Uh, it's in the chunk. You see where the wandering trader llamas are over there on the left? Oh, yeah, yeah. It's right next to that. 
Although I, th hey, dude, you've been making work here. Look at this. Yeah, I know, right? It's 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 really progressing. And I thought yeah. having extra bodies in here was really going to help with that. It turns out the bodies are now just bodies. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. <laughs> I need right. to get my Should two fake over? coins. Uh, give yeah, me, a, yeah. give me a sec, give me a sec. Oh, I'm a state. I'm such a state, Jim. <laughs> you would not believe. <laughs> uh, and, and now the and now the pillagers have showed up. So uh, be careful on your right there. <laughs> there's like a, get away from that. There's a whole Let's mob of them. them. Oh god. I'm right. telling her to get yeah. in the llamas so she can explain herself before this happens. <laughs> look, look at the pillagers all trying to get in. I know. I just saw that. <laughs> Is this the one Lizzie's working on? Yeah. Yeah, yeah, she was yeah, digging yeah. this whole thing out. She just got started on the moss layers. This is hilarious too, because now I've got to spend fake coins. I've got to ask you to spend fake coins. And then I don't get one for for keeping Lizzie alive. Yeah, you you've been caught in a, <laughs> a bit of a, a bit a of a pickle. Here. Bit of a yeah. pickle. I love that I'm about to spend two more coins on Lizzie, where she, I've just spent four coins on our auction thing. I oh, haven't yeah. gone to that thing yet. <laughs> right. Yeah. So Lizzie's spent like Lizzie's got like six of my coins. I've only got two left. I was like the richest on the server with the <laughs> coins. <laughs> yeah, and, and in one fell swoop, now. Lizzie has yeah. somehow demolished that total. Oh, <laughs> oh hey, no. Guys. Oh there no! Oh, Lizzie, what happened? You'll never guess what happened to me. Did the elytra break? Uh, no, I don't think so. No, I was just, I was really excited to get back down into the hole and do some mining. And I, I think I just flew in too fast. Oh no. Oh, you flew in. You didn't just miss the, all the water. Well, I don't really know what happened oh, Lizzie, actually. Oh, oh Lizzie, great, dog? Lizzie, great. Is it, is there's Lizzie a crowd the here. Yep. Everyone gets to see this. <laughs> oh no, Lizzie's a dog. <laughs> Lizzie, Lizzie is a dog, yes. It's unfortunate, but- um, Oh, Lizzie. Yeah. Oh dear Shall me. Shall we get you back? Shall we get you back? Is everyone, are you, yes, yes, please. Oh yeah. my gosh. Me, me and I'm Jimmy- I two fake coins on you, so that means you owe me, all right? And uh, <laughs> I don't know what yeah. you owe me, but you owe me something. You, you owe him half of something because I'm spending my last two as well. We're, me and Jimmy are basically teaming up because I don't have enough fake coins to revive. Oh my, oh my gosh. gosh. It costs People four now. Dying. Yeah, it's, it's very like, expensive. It's very expensive. All right, Jimmy, you this ready to- This isn't even uh, the first time you've revived me this week. I know. <laughs> <laughs> this, is, this is getting to be a habit. Let's uh, let's hop on down and I let's have, do wait, this. Wait, wait. I've always there. wanted to see a wolf jump in. Oh, oh no! My gosh. <laughs> what? Oh, Invincible just... wolf! Incredible. Is there water down there? I'm scared of going down. Woohoo! We're good. We're good. We're good. Oh, that was right. close. Oh my goodness. Well, I appreciate your enthusiasm as an employee, Lizzie, but uh, I have just lost the challenge because it was my job to take yeah, care of you. I'm so sorry. <laughs> oh, I just no, really, no, no, no. really it's fine. love the mining. Yeah, and yeah, I, I don't know. I. I I feel like there's still something I could have done, whether it was like getting you feather falling or, or whatever, but I'm... Uh, no, I'm, nobody I'm, could have saved me from myself. I'm cashing in these coins. The hole is quite fun, isn't it? I've, been, I've done my own. <laughs> I it's love quite it. fun, yeah. I've, I've actually, Pix, I didn't tell you this, um, I've started a whole shrine at my, uh, my base. You, um, you've, not you've, doing a chunk, but a circle. You started. Way down. You started a whole tribute. <laughs> yeah. I was yeah. just. I just. I was a bit scared. I, there's not enough coins to go around for another death. It's true. Oh. It's true. Oh. There we go. And there you are. And. Uh, it is new. And now the. So not embarrassing at all. And now the dog is here. Um. <laughs> if oh. you if you were still oh. possessing the dog, uh, that might have caused a problem. Because <laughs> I think the dog oh, is I now. Oh, I get out the dog. Oh, oh, no. No. oh my gosh! Well, what did you think was going to happen there? Yeah. Oh, I don't know. I thought he meant it was invincible or something. Oh, he I did am, his part. He did his no, part. I am speechless. <laughs> that was so oh, brutal. <laughs> You've done your part. I thought it was going to be invincible. Oh no! Well, um, I think we've all learned some valuable lessons here today. <laughs> Lizzie, how is how is your elytra doing? How is is it still good for durability yep. and stuff? Yeah, yeah, it's still fine. The elytra are fine, actually. I just <laughs> I just fell. Okay, well. I was flying. I just flew into the ground. I think what it is is this block is slightly higher than the oh, rest of the blocks around. Oh, you know what? Around. Yeah, that might have been it. It might have you, you just didn't decelerate early enough. Just had too much momentum. <laughs> oh my god. Now, goodness. if you'll excuse me, I've got some Lizzie, hole mining yeah, to do. Yeah. No dilly dallying. Back to the hole. Back <laughs> to the hole. Oh, okay, oh, yes, sir. No, no, no punching anybody when it's it costs work. four Sorry. coins to revive people. Oh, yeah, now. true. True. Yeah, I think yeah, yeah. we should all be on like pins and needles at this point. We should all be walking on eggshells around each other. I like yeah, this little, little tactic punch. though. You're doing the moss tactic, aren't you? Yeah, Lizzie, yes, Lizzie's mining the method moss protocol. It was started incredibly chaotic and now moss protocol has kicked in and it needs to be, yeah, like just just pure moss all the way down. It's the way. Nice. Yep. 
It's Very moss nice. in time. Yes, moss in time. Well, thank, right. thank you for Big saving mouse. me. Uh, let me know how I can repay you. Yes, no worries. I, I, I'm now short one fake coin in future because I don't get one for keeping you alive now. So uh, yeah. I will that's have. That's my bad. That's oh, fine. But that I, is the look of the draw. You were in charge of keeping. I was. Alive. That's the whole point of this. <laughs> and and to be fair, like I I did a cheeky free cam down through this chunk. There were no like surprises. There's no ancient city under here. There's no like dripstone caves or any like lava lakes or anything. I thought <laughs> tried this, so hard. This was going to be the safest possible chunk for Lizzie to dig out, and somehow, Eloise, somehow, <laughs> it ended up this way. Gravity. Oh, Gravity. Gravity. <laughs> Gravity, the bane of my existence. Thank you, Jimmy. I will I will probably find some way to make it up to you, because, man, that, Look, was, got, that was clutch. I've got some fake coins, so if any of you die again, come knocking on my door. I've got, I want to say four. All right, Ooh, four, four is what you'll need. Well. <laughs> oh, so just I, got yeah, a bunch. I can actually, res people. I, I've just been being revived. I haven't actually <laughs> revived anyone yet. In the last three days, I've spent six on Lizzie. <laughs> <laughs> Wait. <laughs> What? I bought one at, oh, bought you it bought... at the auction. <laughs> yeah, you You've taken scammed. six of my coins in the last two days. <laughs> <laughs> Fantastic. Right. See you All later, right. guys. Thanks, pals. Enjoy the Bye. hole. Thanks. Bye, Jimmy. Bye, Al. I'm so sorry, Pig. <laughs> down. <laughs> no, it's fine. Now you have to you have to update a sign that says zero days since, since last, last accident. Incident. Yeah, absolutely. Yeah. yeah. Oh my goodness. Well, um, yeah. Hopefully everything else goes according to plan, and uh, you know, happy landings and all. <laughs> I'll be so much more careful now. Yeah. Not that it matters now. Yeah, but it still it still matters because gosh, I can't spend another four coins. Yeah, that's true. That's yeah. true. And you can't you can't leave me dead down here. That would be crazy. I still have to technically keep one coin because I owe Owen one from him reviving me, and so now I have oh. to figure out a way to get another coin. Um, we'll oh. we'll see how that works out for me. But uh, I'll yeah. help. I'll help. Don't worry. <laughs> I'll do something dangerous to get a coin. All right. We'll see how that goes. <laughs> Thanks. Bye. Hey, there he is. It's me. I it's... am an angel. <laughs> is that what you are today? Oh, just today. Yes, yes, yes. Uh, I have these wings on me and I can't take them off. So I'm a forever angel. So if you want a, a trident, there is one yes. in here. Uh, <gasps> it, it has five Ooh. durability, so you will need to put mending on it. <laughs> oh, don't worry. I got a one mending villager boy in my hobbit hole. Oh, good work. Yeah. The, the, only, the only other thing you can repair tridents with is other tridents. And I don't have any of those left. So, uh, oh, no. yeah, there was no chance I was going to use that. But, uh, yeah, if people have to get, like, charged creepers to do stuff and whatnot, then uh, then go for it. Yeah, this is going to be very painful. i got to get a charged creeper in the nether. And then i got to go through a portal and not blow up uh, my whole body and die when I go through that portal. Yeah, yeah. Good luck with that part. <laughs> That's going to be yeah. the tricky bit for sure. I think you might need to team up with somebody to, to lure it away from the portal, maybe. Oh, yeah, that's going to be something. Yeah, I do need to. Yeah, because I also have to put uh, a little piglin uh, in a boat waiting for him. Mm -hmm. Oh, that's going to be very hard. And not, hey, and then not despawn in the other side and get somebody randomly. Yes, a lot of, lot of blocking with the shield, probably, is what I'd uh, suggest. It'll be fine. I'll be fine, you know? Yeah, I mean, it's not like people die on this server all the time. It's not like it's not like people have already died in my hole, like, several times at this point. Oh, yeah. Th th what's the count now? It's, four, it's three or four total, including yourself? In um, including me, I think three. Uh, it's definitely been Lizzie. I f and I oh, no, I I'm forgetting the people who died thanks to, like, uh, leaping from build height and trying to water bucket exactly. clash. That's, in that case, it's like six. <laughs> I this think is it's a tomb. <laughs> this is a tomb. This is what you're building. The it's tomb a tomb. The tombs are meant to be around the outside, Sausage. The bit in the <laughs> middle is supposed to be in. fun. Oh. oh, you're surrounded by death all over the place. Yeah, I kind of am. Kind of am. Can't really get away from it, huh? Yeah, it's okay. Uh, don't worry about it. You know, I'm surrounded by death as well because I'm always, I'm always reviving people. I'm like a guardian angel. Actually. You are, you that's are an angel. There you go. That's yeah. that's that's where the wings came from. Yeah, you've earned them at this point. It's not lore. <laughs> it's it's not lore. It's just storytelling. It's just storytelling. <laughs> <laughs> oh, that's gonna be a T-shirt. It's coming. All right, all right. Enjoy the trident. Uh, thank you so much. I'm gonna go repair it and make it pretty. Exciting times. See you later. Wee! Bye bye down your hole and come back up it <laughs> as long as you come back i changed my mind somebody died like that yeah <laughs>